DBS coming at you from downtown Waterloo at KWWL. Our first edition of Unpopular Facts. <laughs> Driving down Real Street, I can't happen to notice a lot of traffic for a Friday night. Mm. We're going to take Fifth Street. John Deere just did some layoffs. And remember, no princesses. I only date crack horse. I don't know. I saw that meme earlier. Okay. So I'm going to go straight. This is a little, uh, little drive through of uh, my old hometown. I remember when I was just seven years old. My daddy moved us out here. He was a, he was a sailor, if you will. A Marine. Mm. Oh, we got a sheriff there in downtown Waterloo. Which is kind of weird because they have their own police. I guess maybe the police needed help. I mean, some of these areas are a little bit rough. Wouldn't really worry about uh, getting robbed so much as I worry about dying. Let me tell you a friendly little story. I actually gave her uh, my tag. Not that you'll ever look it up. DPKS, I go, you can check it out. All that shit happened like last year. Uh, she was telling me a charming story about her brother. This is just like, I don't know, a good reason to pay attention when you're in downtown Waterloo coming at you. Little story about Boss Lady. Gonna head towards Commercial Street, and that was my turn. Fuck. I'm gonna take a left right here, I believe. Yes. Uh, I know Commercial Street. I applied for a job on Commercial Street. They did not hire me. Anywho, uh, Boss Lady was telling me uh, left straight. Uh, going to Commercial Street? Uh, yeah, Commercial takes me where I want to go. Um, yeah. Commercial always takes you where you want to go. Six is my lucky number, baby. I actually came here on purpose to look at the crosswalk. 1616 on 6th Street. Coincidence? Probably. Anywho, Boss Lady was telling me a charming story about her brother uh, who murdered a crackhead in an alley and then was nice enough to dump him off at the uh, funeral parlor. And the reasoning behind that was that uh, Tupac Shakur was murdered. Of course, my my first question was kind of like what's going on with Kobe now with everybody so upset. It's like, oh, is he your best friend? Did he invite you to dinner? Were you in his wedding? Did you grow up together? Oh, that's right. It's just some random celebrity that played basketball. I mean, not even like fucking Tupac. I mean, fucking Tupac spoke to a generation. That's a fucking, I mean, thug life shit. He gets shot five times, fucking walked it off. Fucking walked it off. Are you shitting me? You're telling me he didn't have the right fucking winning mentality? Get shot five times, people are trying to kill him? Shrug it off, bitch. Right? Okay, he had, that's, I mean, that's somebody. Kobe Bryant, what'd you do? Cried like a bitch and died in a helicopter. Congratulations. Why the fuck anybody gives a fuck that he's dead? Beyond me. Not the point. What I'm getting at, as her brother, I believe with two other men, uh, real brain trust we had going on here. Let me uh, finish up, wrap up the story in five minutes. Uh murdered the crackhead in the alley and then was nice enough to drop him off at the uh, funeral parlor, you know, so his parents could pay for the funeral. Apparently, I have no fucking idea. Because Tupac Shakur was murdered. Tupac Shakur. And when questioned, was he friends? Mind you, you already know the answer. I already know the answer. Mm -hmm. Were you friends with Tupac? Was he? No, he was just blah, 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 blah. So you didn't know him or anything, but he got murdered. So you thought the appropriate reaction would be to murder a crackhead that you sell crack to in an alley. So if that has any, if that sheds any light on the mentality of beautiful downtown Waterloo, coming at you from KWWL, driving down Commercial Street, we went from 6 to 15th, hey! Uh, not a big fan of downtown Waterloo. I think if you talk to um, I would say 100% of anybody that I've asked. Uh, one of my favorite questions is, oh, you know, I'm, I'm just visiting, I'm not from here. What's your, what's the, uh, fav what should I see in Waterloo? What's your favorite? Uh, the only answer that I've ever gotten is the casino. That's a bad fucking sign. Uh, left, right, right. Yeah. Right, yeah. I was like 18th, I know that one. Uh... So yeah, that kind of concludes. Just figured we'd do a, because I always make the joke, coming at you from downtown Waterloo. Actually, that's that's not the pitch. Uh, the pitch is, DBKS, coming at you from downtown Waterloo in beautiful blah, blah, blah. I uh, probably fucked up somewhere. Uh, but yeah, uh, 
keep your head on swivel a little bit when you're down here. I've had uh, two incidents that jumped to mine because I don't have a very good memory. Let's go with three because I feel like it was three. Straight uh, or right? Right. And we'll turn on to Washington Street. Anyway, just a little something about the demographics around here. Uh, I'd say I'm not judging, but I totally am. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much all I got. You got anything you'd like to add? Uh, I do not. I don't know. Also, because this already ran over, so we'll just make it a seven minute long video. I'd like to say that a young man has, has been on my mind. Not really. I, I sent him a text, I think, last week, and then I blew his phone up with memes uh, tonight because I thought it was funny when I went out to go grab a Red Bull, but that Red Bull turned into like a fucking two hour trip, mm -hmm. just driving around endlessly, I'm good at that, uh, that he's joining the National Guard, and I'm just, I don't know, I don't think that people with bright futures and intelligence should sign up to take orders from other people, I think that's... I think that's a bad idea. I think that if you have the capability and the mindset, you know, a good head on your shoulders to be generic and the capability, like a brain that functions and a lot of people don't, a lot of people take that for granted, that you can probably make your own way or make some decisions that makes it so you don't have to take orders from other people. That's my uh, soapbox for the night. Anything else to add? Nothing else to add. Well, that wraps it up for DBCast. Leaving downtown Waterloo, coming from KWWL, reporting out of the John Deere Museum that nobody fucking goes to. Uh, taxation is theft, nobody loves you, and uh, lighters.